Miller. It's absolutely great to be with you. I love connecting with you guys through these video features. And one of my favorite aspects of owning an advertising and branding agency is connecting with entrepreneurs. I mean, they could be business owners that are deep in the game, that have been doing it for years, that have been hustling and making money, or they can be entrepreneurs that are early in the game, aspiring entrepreneurs. One of my favorite ones is Shanice Raglan. She is the Chief Executive Officer of We Are Loyalty. Very excited to welcome um, Shanice Raglan here and CEO of We Are Loyalty. Yes. Let's start right there. What is your business about? So my business is about cancer, um, supporting cancer. So basically we're going to bring an apparel to Charlottesville. Well, it's going to be worldwide, so uh -huh. hopefully soon, um, and it's raising cancer awareness. So the apparel is going to give you the benefit to express whatever you've been through, um, through apparel which I always felt like is a great thing. I can wear something on my back to support somebody that's going through something. So I want to support the next person. Awesome answer right there. So We Are Loyalty is, is a merchandise and apparel company. Mm -hmm. um, you got a fantastic logo that we brainstormed together to help bring to fruition. Yeah. And this logo we're going to put on shirts, yeah. hats, yeah. Uh, you mentioned bras, you mentioned shorts. Yeah. And, and then you're going to donate a portion of the proceeds from We Are Loyalty to Cancer Research. Yes, sir. Um, why cancer? Were, were you touched by it? Yes. So my brother, um, his mother, his grandma, his aunt, they all passed away due to cancer. So that kind of touched me, um, just seeing him go through it and having to experience it so young. Um, so I chose cancer. So cancer's been, you know, everyone seems to be touched by cancer, unfortunately. So it's a very um, altruistic and philanthropic and positive mission. I love that. Uh, you're CEO of a company now. I mean, <laughs> you're getting into the thick here. Yeah. What are some of the what are some of the uh, successes that you like so far of, of being a, an owner of a company? What I like so far is just basically being able to touch other people. I've always wanted to do that through something. I didn't know what kind of what it was. I'm, you know, I'm young, so I didn't know what it was. However, I am getting my bachelor's degree in healthcare, so going through, you know coursework and everything it, it just makes it open up and then when my brother went through it I kind of bam that's it you know cancer touches a lot of people um, I love people so doing this that's one of the successes um, I'm, is I am finding though that it's it, it's, it's a tough cookie. It's a lot to deal with. So no doubt, I'm going through the grooves of that. You know, putting in inventory and just doing it. It's a lot to it. So isn't it amazing? And one of the things that I found challenging with running my businesses is every day. It seems like you're wearing like 15 different hats. Yes. I mean, you're like a designer. Yeah. You're like merchandising. Yeah. You know, you're having to do like you know uh, forecasting. Like, is this going to sell? Is this not going to sell? I mean, does that excite you? I mean, put that in perspective. I, it does excite me because I got me and my husband were going back and forth. Oh, what's going to go with this? And what's going to go with that? And the companies, they want you to do it. So, right. you know, I was like, well, can you kind of tell me what's going to look like? They're like, no, you have to spell it out, write it out, do it. So, and that's. <laughs> that's the hardest part I can say. No you doubt. Know, putting the, you know, getting the inventory and, and pushing it. So, but I think it's going to be a success. Yeah. Well, and on top of that, Shanice, put it in perspective for the viewers here. You come from an entrepreneurial family. Yes. My mother and my father own their own business. So uh -huh. my mother does hair, international hair. She's uh -huh. been doing that for a very long time now. My father, he's um, he got his own construction business and that's nice. Wolfox Roofing. So. I just feel like it runs. Right? So, I mean, it's in your blood. Yes. You grew up in an entrepreneurial family, yeah. internal, intra, uh, entrepreneurial mindset. I mean, how about the challenges? I mean, there's, I feel like with business ownership, it's like, it's, it's almost like one step forward, two steps back every yeah. day. And it's like, every day it's like, dang, I got hit in the gut today. And it's just having to like deal with that yeah. and like managing that adversity and keep going forward. Some of the challenges you've experienced. The challenges so far that I have experienced is just basically, like I said, not knowing what's going to happen. So I don't know um, what what size you wear, uh -huh. or what color you want, or what you've actually been through. However, that's why I'm offering a variety of things so you can pick what you're going through. I want my apparel, you'll be able to express what you're going through. So if you're going through breast cancer, we'll have a shirt for that. If you're going through lung cancer, we'll have a shirt for that. We'll have a water bottle for that. You know, it's going to be different things. Love it. That. That's the only challenge so far that I've encountered. So. Where are we going to find it? Where are we going to get it? You're going to get it, so I'm going to have a website. Okay. It's going to come soon. Um, and like I said, I wanted to launch on October the 1st. 
Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Yeah, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Um, and like I said, it's not focusing on breast sure, cancer. Sure, sure. It's not focusing on I just want this to be a variety of cancers. So I don't want anybody, I just feel like every business goes towards breast cancer. Breast cancer, breast cancer. There's so many different cancers out there. Totally. And everybody is touched. Like right, September, Childhood Awareness Cancer. So, you know, it's, it's so many. But yes, October the 1st, cancer, breast cancer awareness. And you got you got a business as good as the people as the people you know. Yeah. You got some hookups in the retail world yeah. that potentially could carry the merchandise. Yeah. Um, so I'm excited to see it. Uh, how about events? I mean, I feel like you, with your personality, you're outgoing, people like you, yeah. you're from the area. Yeah. I mean, I feel like your business is primed for like some big time events, maybe Tonsler Park. Yeah, so I'm thinking, um, like I said, not set, set in stone yet, but I'm thinking a launch party. Nice. So, um, and that's, I'm thinking the day before the launch. Okay. I mean, that's just to put it out there. Um, I'm going to have some merchandise there to okay. be able to be able to buy and then like I said the website will launch and then I'll have another big event coming up in the middle of October and that's probably gonna I'm thinking a walk and that's just the fundraiser a walk and you know you'll be able to go on that website and buy some apparel if you want to be you want to walk in it and you know grab a water bottle whatever I like it since we met we'll wrap it up here since we met I've always given you props on your look and your your your, uh, your design your feel for clothing yeah. you, you you really love to uh, you look good you know, you look good. So the fact that you're like owning a clothing company yeah. just fits like what some of your passions are by nature. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's exciting and I'm excited for this event. Shanice Raglan, CEO of We Are Loyalty. We're going to follow her business closely as it booms here in Charlottesville, as it booms in the state, as it booms across the country. Yeah. Shanice, you rock. Thank you. You yeah. rock too. <laughs> Thank you very much. Shanice Raglan, watch her closely guys.